Man, so the L.A. Dodgers just won their World Series last night against the New York Yankees. So, um, you know, this is L.A.'s second title within the last four years. I believe they won in 2020, yeah. Well, Magic Johnson posted about his, because uh, he's a part owner of the team, and he just posted about, you know, his team winning the World Series. Now, one thing that he did say that everybody's talking about is that he now has 15 rings. And um, I, I'm I'm. St- I'm starting to wonder, is he maybe the greatest winner in sports ever? And I and I get it. A lot of people got Mike as the GOAT, really, in, in damn near all sports, but at least from a basketball standpoint. But I'm talking about as far as just when it comes to win, everything, everything that Magic touched turns to gold. Think about it, right? I feel like he won a state title in high school, but don't quote me on that. But I mean, he went, he went, he went, he ran, he won one as a player at Michigan State. He won five as a player for the Lakers. He owned a portion of the Lakers, which in turn gave him five more rings. He's won two as the LA Dodgers. He's on one as a WNBA owner with the Los Angeles Sparks. And he uh, won as an owner of the of his MLS team, the Los Angeles Football Club. And he also recently was part of an ownership group that bought the Washington Commanders. And they got uh, Jaden Daniels, who many believe, uh, believe should have been the number one overall pick to the Chicago Bears over Caleb Williams. Now, let me say this. Let me say this. I still got Mike as the GOAT. But I mean, really, when you think about a, a, a span, right, of a lifetime, not just on the court, but on the court, off the court, Magic might be the greatest winner. You know what I'm saying? I mean, think about it. The man has 15 rings when you combine as a player and an owner from college all the way up. As competitive as Mike is, I'm sure Mike would have, that would have solidified Mike as an owner if he would have won, let's say, one or two championships with the Charlotte Hornets. Um, I know he's bigger than NASCAR, and he said NASCAR almost gives him the same edge. But, like, let's say that he's – um. Like Hendrick, Hendrick's, uh, I think it's Hendrick Sports, Hendrick Motorsports, where they had Dale Earnhardt and um, everybody else, Dale Earnhardt Sr. and Dale Earnhardt Jr. at one point. Jimmy Johnson, I believe Jeff Gordon. If Jordan were to start winning the NASCAR, now we gotta have a, we gotta have a different conversation about about just not him being the go on the court, but in the office. You know what I mean? And when it comes to Magic, I mean, my God, the business ventures. Yeah, Jordan got business ventures and other players like Shaq. Um, when it comes to winning, but even like with Shaq, Shaq owns a portion of the Sacramento Kings. They haven't won a championship. I'm just saying as far as like just a career span, I mean, from what? From a uh, sophomore at Michigan State to an owner, you know. And he even said that the only thing that he never won was a football trophy. <laughs> or, mean, yeah, a championship in football. So just think about it. He may not have the most rings as far as like in a particular sport, you know, as, as you got a, a Bill Russell and Jordan and uh, several more players, uh, Robert Horry, technically. They got more rings than him. But when you're talking about ownership and being a player, I mean, it, <laughs> he might be the GOAT, honestly. But I didn't want to get my quick thoughts about it. I didn't want to make a long video about it. I honestly want to know y'all opinions, man. Uh, let me know in the comment section below. Is he the GOAT when we're talking about winning overall? I know Kareem won high school, college, and an NBA, but still I didn't win. And I mean, also he won, obviously, with Magic. But I'm talking about as far as, like, as Magic is still winning in his 60s. He's still winning. He, you know what I'm saying? He's still celebrating championships. He's had, He's been very successful successful in business outside of just owning sports teams. So, yeah, I don't want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.